Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guests are the true definition of power couple. She's a Grammy Award winning solo artist and he is an NAACP Image Award winning actor and comedian. Now after 30 years Oof. of marriage, my God, they're out with a new book and music project which honors their love story called Us Against the World. Please <laughs> welcome down to the circle, David and Tamala Mann. Yay! Yay! Whatever you do. Musical chairs. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh it's so good to see you. I'm so excited. Y'all don't know how long we've been here. trying to get here. Oh my God. We're happy to be in the circle. Yes. <laughs> glad to have you at the circle. the circle. Okay, first of all, what I think everybody wants to know, especially me, 30 years of marriage, what is the love story? Did you guys come together um, creatively? How did you guys meet and, and begin and fall in love and stay 30 years? Well, my best friend introduced us. We went, um, she had a class with him, she had a music class with him. Mm -hmm. and. He was singing in a group with Kirk Franklin, Franklin. Uh, yeah, and I passed her Dara uh -huh. Blair, and then she she was like, "Y'all can sing, but I got somebody who can sing better than y'all." Wow! So she took me to the she school. Did. I <laughs> she did. I sang for them, and then it's like we kept running into each other. But like, look, the crazy part is we hadn't ran into each other until we met. Then after that, we started running into each other like all the time. All the time. So it was meant to be uh, either that or she was stalking me. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, I think seriously. she was stalking me. <laughs> You guys were teenagers, right? We were yeah. 19. 19. 19 years old. Golly, years. Jeepers Alive. We've known each other. We've known but each other but did you guys time. try to like run into each other on purpose? Would you say, okay, he's gonna be here? I'm gonna make sure my makeup looks real, real cute today. Right. You know what I'm saying? It was like, not. I didn't know that they were gonna be there, but at the time, as he said, we were kind of locally famous. <laughs> you know, okay. so local. it's like we were singing, so we were just running into the same events. And then we was like into church, so it was like that's all we had. We had no money. Church was free. Yeah, you could go there right. and sing for free. <laughs> So that's what we were doing, and we were just running into each other. So, oh my God, okay, so you, you guys both sing and act. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which do you prefer, or is there a preference? Depend on which one of us you ask. I prefer singing. Mm -hmm. I feel I'm more comfortable there. Mm -hmm. And I prefer acting. I'm, that's my thing. But the good thing is we get to operate in each other's world. Yes. Mm -hmm. Like she gets to come into the, the acting world. She only the people don't know she only started acting just he, to kind of like appease me. He, like, pushed, he, pushed, he pushed me. me. He yeah. pushed me. <laughs> but, but I'm glad he did. I'm glad. Yeah, he me did. too, child. I'm glad. Because <laughs> if he didn't, we would have never met. I mean, we would. <laughs> So yeah, we, we did Meet the Browns together. Yes. Yeah, the Ions ago. That's yeah. when we first met. Mm -hmm. and, and, and lie a good man. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you, and, and this is where I got who put me on the program. I got that put from, you on the program. I got okay. that from David Mann. Yes. <laughs> and I'm telling you, and I still, you uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I want my wig to fall off. But, you know, <laughs> but now you guys have evolved so much since then. You have so much going on. I'm so oh, happy wow. and so proud well, for you thank guys. You. Thank you. You've got your music. You've got your books. Just do acting. You have your television show everything together with the family. Yeah. I mean, just how do you do it every day? <laughs> like, who? Well, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. And it feels really good to be able to do things with my whole family mm -hmm. and to interact with my husband and my kids. But to be able to do even this book together yeah. and to share our story, I think it's to encourage families, encourage families to stay together and not give up on each other. That's what this book is all mm -hmm. about and the reason why we, we did, did this book. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Speaking of this book, you guys shared a lot of intimate things. Mm -hmm. um, 30 years of marriage, there's there's ups and downs. Yes. You know there's ups yes. and downs. Yes. <laughs> and, and, and you talk about, I mean, because I'm 14 years and there's ups and downs. Yeah. Yeah. So you guys, I, I know you talk about in the book, uh, David has three children outside of the marriage. So why were two, you, two, 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 two children mm -hmm. outside of the marriage? Excuse Don't me. Don't give me another no, one. No, I'm just oh, I'm just reading the card. I'm just no, reading the card. It's okay. Did I find out it's somebody okay. know about? No. <laughs> Jesus is child since it's Mary. But, um, so you have two children outside of the marriage. Mm -hmm. But um, you guys were okay with talking about that in the book. Tell us why it was important to talk about um, having two children. You know, we marriage. felt that our story could help somebody else. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, you know, you, you know, as we went on tour this year, you kind of get a little discouraged. Is this really helping? Right. And we had one couple that was separated, and they had the same story that we did about mm -hmm. the knock at the door, finding mm -hmm. out about a child oh, later on in their yes. marriage. 
and it wound up helping them. They got back together because they heard our story. Wow. And so it let us know it's all worth it. Yeah. And wow. so we wanted to make sure that our story would inspire somebody else to stay together. Absolutely. And that's awesome. It that Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We're back with David and Tamla Mann, and they're going to give us some more love advice, and I can't wait for it. Yeah. Yes. Uh. That's so sweet. You so, want to go first? You want me to go first? Well, I was dying to ask her this okay, question. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Know okay. Was, no, no. I was, was just wanted to tell she her. She said, I was dying to ask her. <laughs> dying. I'm from Chicago. And me I'm too. I'm from Texas. Come on now. I, I, one of the things that I do on my show, First of all, Change Me was a song mm -hmm. that, um, that our, our glam squad would play the gospel every music. Day, and it used to come day. on and I used to be like, oh my God, this song is amazing. Oh, I just wow. want you to know, um, I sing that in my set. Wow. Really? Yes, and, and, and I love your music. I love you guys. And, and speaking of your music, this album, um, why? Why together? Because separately you do your thing. We, we see you all the time, but why together this singing album? Well, I th well the, the book actually inspired the music because mm -hmm. a lot of the stories that we talk about in the book, mm -hmm. we sang in, we're singing about them yes. on this, the Love Project. And this uh, was the first time that we did, we'd done an album together, together yes. because I was too afraid to do an I album with, why. I was afraid to do an album with Tamala Mann, quite honestly. All right, but the all first right. two hours we went in to record, I, I totally talked myself out of it. Wow. And it almost didn't happen. I'm glad it did. But then wow. she, she, my biggest cheerleader right here, oh, she was okay. like, yeah. I'm, I'm happy. Okay, so speaking of the book, we're going to surmise and I'm going to ask you one big old question. Okay. What is the key to keeping your love spicy and alive? Oh. After 30 years. <laughs> I, 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 could give I, one. I don't know if it could be one. Our foundation is our friendship. But I like this guy, and Ooh. I'm in love with him, and right, I enjoy, right. we enjoy each other's Aww. company. Now, what you and we, we, that? Uh, well, we, like she said, we based everything on our friendship, because had we not been friends, we mm -hmm. probably wouldn't be together. Right. Wow. Had we not have, I, like, because when I was mad or upset mm -hmm. with my wife or my girlfriend at the time, I probably, you know, I probably would have been like, nah, I'm done, I'm good. But she was my friend, and I wanted to hang out with my friend. Mm -hmm. Okay, but now it's 30 years. You're about to do a movie now. Mm -hmm. Merry Wishmas. My sister Tawanda's in yes. it. Yes. Give us a 15 second, second summary of it. Uh, the summary is it's talking about family. I, I had the leading role in this movie. Yes. But, but it's about forgiveness mm -hmm. and a love. It's like I was so worked up into work that I was for forgot about family and forgot about love. And your yeah. sister was a hoot in it. She was my love interest, yeah. which I wasn't yeah, interested in. Did y'all have to kiss on the mic? No, but she wanted to. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I, 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 so okay. was something else in this movie, y'all. But look, y'all gonna have to watch the movie, and guess what? You guys gotta go out and get their books everywhere. Yes. Books are yes. sold. Yes. Yes. Merry Christmas is coming December 2nd on at 7 o'clock Central on TV1. Yes. And of course, the conversation always continues at Sister Circle TV on all social media platforms. Yay. So stay with us.